In this video, I'm going to write these two systems of ODEs in matrix form. So we have those two systems there. So I'll start by looking at this first one here. We can write this system in the form x prime is equal to a multiplied by x. In this case, we see that we have two dependent variables x and y. So our x here will be a column matrix which has the variables x and y. And the x prime, it will be the derivative of x, which will just be a column matrix which has the derivatives of the variables x and y. And the matrix A will be a 2 by 2 matrix, and the elements of A will be the coefficients of the variables x and y in the given system of ODEs. So in this case, when you look at uh, the system of ODEs that we have here, for the first one here, we see that the coefficient of x here is a minus 2. The coefficient of y here is a 1. For the second equation there, the coefficient of x is a 5. The coefficient of y is a 2. Those coefficients form the matrix A. So we have our A there. The matrix of coefficients is minus 2, 1, 5, 2. We can now write our system of all DEs in this form here. So what we'll be having there is our x prime, we say it is x prime y prime is equals to the matrix A minus 2, 1, 5, 2 multiplied by the column matrix there, x, y. So that's the matrix form there of the given system of ODEs. I can now go on to the next one where we are given this system of ODEs there. We are having three equations, the derivative of x with respect to t, the derivative of y with respect to t, the derivative of z with respect to t. But if we look at uh, this first equation there, it is an x there on the right hand side, the other coefficients will be zero. But for us to see our matrix, it will be better if we write that uh, equation and the other two equations there in full, including the zeros. So our system there, is the same as the derivative of x with respect to t is equals to minus c1x plus 0y plus 0z. Then the derivative of y with respect to t is equals to cx minus c2y plus 0z. The third one is the derivative of z with respect to t is equals to 0x plus c2 multiplied by y plus 0z. So I just wrote uh, that one in full there to indicate where we have the zeros. So what we see there is we have three dependent variables, x, y, and z. So in this case, our column matrix with the variables will be x is x, y, z. And for the x prime, it will be the derivative of that x. So for the x prime, it will be the derivative of the dependent variables x prime, y prime, z prime. In this case, our matrix A, we are having three variables. So our matrix A will be a three by three matrix and the elements of the matrix A will be the coefficients of the variables X, Y, Z in the given system of ODEs. So in this case, if we look at our system here, what we see is for the first equation here, the derivative of X with respect to T, the coefficient of X is minus C1. The coefficient of Y is a zero. The coefficient of Z is a zero. Go to the next equation, the coefficient of x is a c1, coefficient of y is a c2, coefficient of z is a 0. Go to the next equation, the coefficient of x is a 0, the coefficient of y is a c2, and the coefficient of z is a 0. So those coefficients, they form the matrix A. So we have our A is the matrix which has elements minus c1, 0, 0. C1 minus C2, 0, 0, C2, 0. Now write our system of ODEs in this form here. We have our X prime. We say it is this one here. So we have X prime, Y prime, Z prime. And then we write our matrix A. Our matrix A we are saying is this one here. So it will be minus C1, 0, 0, C1 minus C2, 0, 0, C2, 0. And then we write our x. Our x we are saying is this one here, so it will be x, y, z. So what you are having here, 
that's the matrix form of this system of ODEs.